six. Oh my, this, no, 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 no. Ew. All right, welcome back, guys. More COD Mobile time. This time, instead of grinding a gold weapon, we're going to be grinding Undead Siege. We haven't made a ton of videos on this, but overall, I'm super excited. In this video, we are going to be maxing out the talent tree, which is just like the skill system from Cold War. However, it's a little bit different. You get... Um, you get these weird crystals and these crystals, you get it by doing challenges, daily challenges, battle pass. It's not like the Aether crystals done quite a bit differently. As you can see, we've got all of them maxed out per one and we got tons of them here. So we've got, obviously there is the turret weapon and we've got this maxed out. And once you get it to all the way up to level 20, uh, when you have four or more laser turrets, fire rate for all turrets increased by 50%. You get the turret armor. Uh, which obviously increases the defense. Once you get it to 20, when you have two or more tar turrets, the explosion damage will increase. And now we have the weapon upgrade. Let's go ahead, get all the way up to talent level one freaking hundred. That is insane. This is for weapon damage. All right, so now uh, when you have two or more sentry turrets at max level, damage to zombies increases by 30%. Uh, toughness, which is player XP, the level 20 reward players in the control center will recover HP a little bit faster, which is really cool. Then probably the most OP out of everything, wrench damage for the final one. When you have four types of turrets, repair increases by 100% doubles, which, yeah, now we are talent level 100. And you know what? I am excited to go test this out. We are going to test it out in a public game on Undead Siege Nightmare Mode, which... Nightmare mode is pretty freaking hard. I, d I can beat it if I have a team of people that I know that I'm playing with. Playing in a public game, maybe not so much. But, you know, we're level 100 now, so I guess I guess we could try it out. But, uh, dude, it, it really comes down to the teammates we get. Uh, fingers crossed, boys. We're going to need it for that. While we're loading in, if you're new here and want to sub, I would greatly appreciate that. And on top of that, I got to give a massive thanks to everyone who like, comment, and watch this video in its entirety. And I do not have a good feeling about this whatsoever. Yeah, okay, cool. Here we are, finally loaded into game, and we load loaded into a game that's already been started for a little bit, so I guess we'll we'll loot up on night one here. We'll get what we can done. Uh, but yeah, this is a pre-started game. But let's see how efficient and exactly what happens when you max out the skill tree. So now that it's maxed out, are we going to be able to beat Undead Siege with a bunch of randoms? I We will try our best. We're going to go try hard mode here. Uh, I think there is a way you can look up the levels of the other people. This is going to be fairly tough. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. So we go here. We got level 51, 78, 98. Okay. Okay, I'm feeling we got we got a 98. That's it's pretty close to 100. I'm I'm feeling all right. We'll just we'll have to see. This is going to be I've never beaten nightmare mode in a public game before. I don't think I've done it ever once. Then then again, I haven't tried it a ton of times, but um boys, I just I need you to wish me a little bit of luck here and maybe if we do get it we'll get the dark matter camo on some of the weapons you can only unlock by playing this that's really the main reason you want to play nightmare mode is you can unlock dark matter camo for i think the dhr and one of the pistols by playing this so maybe at the end of this game we'll get a little bit of loot drop luck yeah okay so night one's going all right i mean for, <laughs> it's definitely harder than the normal hard mode night one but i mean we we did pretty well here let's go ahead collect the ammo on top of this we're going to be using the pkm because there are still two weapons in this game that i do not have the aether crystal camo for and i want to be able to unlock it for all the melee weapons which means we got to finish off the crossbow and the pkm well i think it's two more games with each so unfortunately we can't unlock it in this game but if we grind it out we can get it the next game we play which won't be in this vod probably be its own vod but uh yeah I mean, so far, it's not terrible. We can get the ray gun, though. The thing about hard, we've been grinding it hard. There's no there's no ray gun in uh, hard. you got to be playing Nightmare. So as we get to higher rounds, maybe we'll get a little appearance from the ray gun popping out, helping us out. So, uh, you know, we got our fingers crossed for a lot of things right now. You know, we got our fingers crossed to actually win it. We got our fingers crossed to get a Dark Matter variant, and we got our fingers crossed to get a ray gun. But, you know, we're, we're running out of fingers to cross at this point, but uh, I'm I'm still keeping out hope. I'm just going to I'm going to keep crossing all of the fingers let me go ahead and get 25 kills with this we we do need to loot like usually when i'm playing hard i don't loot a lot but if we don't have our turrets upgraded we're not gonna get anything done like we really gotta be on top of it so uh yeah loot 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 
All right, night two, we actually looted a lot. Hopefully these guys kind of play by the rules. You know, if you're playing in a public lobby or playing with people, you always want to throw your materials in as soon as possible. So we got one of the heavy turrets. My goal is to use different upgrade paths. So we got a heavy turn on this side. This one's gonna be a grenade turret because I really want that additional 100% repair boost because that is what is gonna help us more than anything. Being able to repair at an insane rate is going to be super helpful. I know I haven't dropped off my supplies yet. I'm going to wait till I'm able to upgrade my turn. I will drop them off before the end of the night. But uh, yeah, that is a key success. If having people who know that you really just need to like, if you selfish with the supply drops and the stuff that you get, you are not going to win. You guys have got to share all the materials, <laughs> spread them out among the people. Because if one person just hogs them all, like, because you might have something that one other person needs and you have stuff that they need. So once we upgrade it one more time, I know I have enough to get one more tier here. Then we will drop all of our loot for everyone to use. Wait, do we not? I thought we... Okay, maybe we don't have enough. No, maybe I'm wrong. I thought... Okay, I guess not. I guess not. All right, let me drop them off. And deposit. Boom. There we go. And then we'll... Oh, now we have enough. Oh, redeploy. I picked it up. Nice. Okay, cool. All right, but I'm gonna... Dude, this is... Ooh, this is already getting a little, a little stressful here. A little bit stressful. Luckily enough, we can farm these dudes for a ton of points. We just don't have any of the upgrade stuff needed. And it doesn't look like anyone else has applied anything to the uh, chest system. So it is just just us. You know, maybe if we request it, maybe they'll be nice. Like, hey, I'm looking for some materials. If you... Oh, I forgot about the cards, too. Bro, this is this is just not going to... This ain't going to happen. They're not sharing any materials. Is what I was afraid of. I think, I think we'll be okay. We'll pass this night, but... We just, we just don't have that foundation. We just don't have that foundation, but there's still hope. I'm not giving up hope. We can, we can pull this run around, boys. There is, there is a chance where there is a will, there is a way. Okay, night number three, and this might be where we lose. 27 seconds left. Can we keep everything alive? We keep getting the stupid EMP storm. I forgot. This is one thing that makes the hard mode even more hard is these, these little events that go down, which I, or I mean nightmare, not hard. We, I mean, we've beaten Nightmare. I've beaten it quite a few times, but it's always been with a party. I've just never been... Oh, dude, that EMP storm every time. I've never been able to manage to do it. And oh, oh, well, we're about to lose one of our freaking turrets. Oh, rip. I don't know where it is. I don't know where that green one... Oh, come on. It was right there. I cannot believe we just lost that. Wow, that was uh, that was a pretty massive loss. We definitely have to get supplies. Unfortunately, no one on... um. Our team is putting anything in the... I keep putting mine at the end of every round, but honestly, I got to stop putting mine in there because every time I put my crap in there, it proceeds to disappear and never gets replaced. <laughs> so we we kind of just need to chill out a little bit with that. I've never bought a bunch of perks in this. So let's... let's we got the we got the spare cash. We just don't have the stuff to upgrade anything. So let's, let's buy some of these perks, you know? Help us out a little bit, even though we all know that the turrets do most of the work in the zombies mode. Let's go to the objective and see if we can get supplies there. I'm not sure what this objective is, um, but it is probably going to be our best way to get supplies. And that is what we're low on before the end of the night. We've got to be supplied up because having one purple turret is not enough. We've got a common and two green, so we, we have got to get stuff. I wish I would have been putting all of it in the... The shared community chest because all that stuff has now disappeared and I really <laughs> kind of I kind of wish we had it at this point. All right. Here we go. Which objective is this? Okay, this one's not bad. We should be we should be fine here. Let's go ahead. We need to get 12 kills in total with the crossbow. Is it going to let me shoot again? There we go. And then we're just going to laser him with the LMG. Oh, we might not have enough bullets. We might not have enough bullets. We might not have enough bullets. But we really do need to take him down. We need that loot, baby. I know you still get the loot even if you don't take them down, but I'm pretty sure you get better loot. Little disappointed we haven't found a ray gun. Oh, we might die here. Yeah, he's coming with vengeance. He's coming with vengeance, baby. He's down. He's down. He's down. Full auto. Full auto. PKM. Let's go. And run. And run. Get far enough away. And then just full auto again. Full auto again. Full auto again. Full auto again. He's getting so low. Come on. Give me the loot, baby. No backing up. No backing up. We're just going to full force it. All right. Come on. There we go. That's the loot I'm looking for. Give me all of the loot. I need all of this. Yes. Okay. Now we should be able to upgrade some of our crap at the beat. No, no, no. Don't pick up that. Don't pick up that. We, we've got, we want to keep this LMG. LMG good. That little PP on the ground is meh. Pick up all the crap. Pick up all the crap. Pick up all the crap. 
No loot left behind. That is our motto here. No loot left behind. No loot left behind. Pick it all up. Pick it all up. And yes, now we now we've got a lot, and we don't need all this. We can share some of this with our teammates. So hopefully they can hopefully they can get some use out of the large amount of stuff. And we also got sniper bullets, which is what we need for the crossbow because we're still trying to get the uh ooh, where are we over near this area we're still trying to get the 12 kills needed with this we're pretty close i think we've got about 10 so hopefully we'll make progress for both the pkm and the crossbow luckily enough we just got two weapons left which make the pr progression pretty easy and then one more game and we'll have aether crystal camo and everything and there are three weapons in the game right now we're missing the gold camo for and we'll be completely caught up and all the mastery camos in cod mobile all the final tier mastery. We won't have diamond on anything, but you don't need diamond to get the final tier masteries. You just need gold and the Aether Crystal, and we'll be good. There's not a single zombie here, bro. This place is a ghost town. I came here to slot. Dude, there's not a single zombie here. What the heck? Bro, legit. There's... Uh, uh, okay, cool. Boom. There we go. Day five. One more night remains. We might actually be able to do this. This will be the first time I've ever finished Nightmare in a public... Oh, wait. We're, we're already here. Sick. All right, the main thing stopping us is just more loot. We just constantly are needing more and more loot. I would love to get a freaking ray gun. But uh, no, unfortunately, still haven't seen that. We've kind of looked around and it, I don't know. I've been playing a lot of Undead Siege, but I haven't got to have the ray gun because we've been playing hard mode. We haven't been playing all, ooh, loot, loot, loot. All right, let's go ahead. I'm pretty sure we've got all the kills we need for everything. Oh, this area sucks. This area is so easy just to get trapped in. I mean, it's legitimately in the middle of a freaking maze. Ah! Oh my, bro. The FOV and the way I'm running, I can't see anything. Oh, they even landed a helicopter here and they're... Oh, bro, I'm gonna get turned around so many... Dude, I can't. I can't. I can't. I'm in the middle of the maze. Oh my. Dude, it's so easy just to get absolutely lost in here. I keep turning around too quick. There we go. There we go. All right reload let's take this sucker down wait does he even have a health bar no don't you have to go up and like interact with it first yeah god dang it I, every one of my teams just shooting it you have to interact with it before you can shoot it how do they not realize the health bar wasn't going down he's just sitting here lighting it up all right oh man this is gonna take a lot of bullets look at how slowly that's going down honestly we might be better off with our wrench we have not pack a punch this at all and it clearly shows yeah so final night we really didn't get any supplies needed to upgrade much of anything <laughs> we got one of our green turrets to blue and no i've i've requested supplies and nothing has been input in there unfortunately i just didn't get enough because they kind of took everything when it opened up so uh i don't have a good feeling about this we're just really underprepared so i mean i could sit here and repair this it's just hopefully they've got really good turrets because I would hope so, because they've got all the supplies. So hopefully they're, they've got some good orange ones, some of the legendary tier crap, because we are just, we're going to be on repair duty. We cannot afford to lose this green turret, though. We've got to make sure this school, yeah, this is not going well. This is not going well. I think we can do it. We just got to hold out for three minutes. I think it, I think it can happen. We just got to get this up. And as soon as we get this up, we got to buy war machines and just do as much damage as we can to everything around here. Clear the area. Clear the area. <laughs> Get rid of these guys as quick as possible. I mean, we can heal pretty quickly. Unfortunately, I'm not able to use the tier 10 wrench ability. Uh, but even without that, just kind of repairing it as buying items that allow us to just do insane amounts of damage. All right, use this to snipe these guys out. Oh, no. Okay, we, we got to use all the ammo in this quick because I got to start healing again. I got to start healing again. I got to start healing again. All right, run out of ammo, death machine. Death machine, run away. All right, and now we heal. I think, I think it's possible. I think it's really going to come down to the wire. So, so far, we want to do three things this game. The ray gun's out of the option. It's too late in the game to get the ray gun. So, it comes down to two more things. We wanted to beat it, and if we beat it, I wanted to try to get one of the uh, dark matter camos. So... But the other two things are still potentially on the table. We've only lost one of them. You should be able to buy a nuke in this. You should be able to buy a nuke in this. You know, for enough points, you should be able to... Uh, and just clear the field. Because I got points. I just don't have any materials. 
Oh, this war machine might not have been a good idea. The war machine just just so much radius damage. Okay, yeah, we still got it. We still got it. Minute 40 left. As long as we keep the turrets up, I think, I think, I think, I think we could have this. Just focus on repairing. Let the turrets do the work. Let the turrets do the work. Okay, we got to get rid of these guys, though. These things are bad freaking news. They just heal the zombies, so those got to go. And they buff the zombies, so... If no one else will get them, I will get them. That is why they're even late. Oh my, dude, they're all over. Okay, I, I guess that, that will be my job this game. I'll go around getting rid of these dudes. All right, we, we got a crossbow that does a ton of damage. We should probably use that to get rid of them. Yeah, there we go. That's a little bit more efficient. All right, you guys repair. I'll snipe the necromancers. All right, nope, I guess I'll snipe the necromancers, and then I'll come back, and I'll repair. Oh, no, a minute left. Okay, there's a lot of them on it. But luckily, there's no necromancers, so hopefully the turrets can do a lot of damage to them. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. This is really going to come down to the wire. We got to repair this, though. We got to repair. No, no, no. That's the wrong one. That's the wrong one. I was okay. We cannot lose this turret. We will lose the game if we lose this turret. So it's okay. Get that instead of healing the base. All right. Now go back to healing the base. 38 seconds remain. Heal. Oh, and we're almost losing one of our purple ones. I think we got this. I, I think we got this. 30 more seconds. We just got to make 30 more seconds this turret is taking the brunt of the damage little turret that could oh we can upgrade to another purple one yes oh that's gonna help with 18 seconds left by the time all right i think i think we got this oh no 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 okay it is taking a lot of damage actually relatively quickly 11 10 9 8 7 6 oh my this no 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 okay Oh my, that is closer than I ever thought it would be. So there we go. That is what happens when you get everything tier 20 and you're level 100 in the tier uh, level up tree. We just did nightmare mode in a public lobby, which I have never done before. I am really going to be surprised. I want to see what these damage numbers look like because they were hoarding all the material. So I would assume they'd have some really high level turrets, but uh, no, it, it appears. I don't know what they were doing with them. What were they doing with all the materials? They were hoarding all the materials and they weren't building anything. Oh man, doesn't matter. We still won even though it was on the nick of time. So one of the three things have been accomplished. There is one more thing that I wanted to accomplish. What are our rewards? Oh crap, did I skip over it? What do we get? Oh, all common crap. Not fun at all. But hey, luckily, oh wow, look. <laughs> oh, ton of XP tokens, ton of these. Dude, whenever they add new um, Undead Siege Rewards. Oh, tier 70 in the Battle Pass, even though it caps out at 50. Uh, whenever they add new Undead Siege stuff, dude, we're going to have so many of these credits. So let's check down here. Camo Rewards. Let's go to LMG. We're missing one here. One more game for that. Go to Pistol. Last one here. One more game. I'm excited. And then we'll have Aether Crystal for everything unlocked and we can play just normal hard for that with that guys i'm gonna wrap this one up thank you so much especially watching all the way to the end if you are currently playing cod mobile what is your talent level have you maxed out the skill tree are you level 100 yet uh and i mean they add these pretty much i think every time they do an undead siege update so hopefully we'll be ready to max it out as soon as they add more to it uh as always we got daily cod mobile minecraft content uploaded on this channel we have a main channel where we upload main uh, COD Zombie Games content there. And then we got a Facebook page. We're uploading daily story game mode playing through God of War. I definitely recommend checking that out. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh, hey there. Thank you for watching the entire video. I've got to take this last moment here to give a huge thanks to everyone who came to Twitch sub, our YouTube member, and an extra special thanks to those who have taken above and beyond and became an Unlock Plus Plus member on YouTube. We've got the 2X Trader Purple. We've got the most OP Gobblegum ever, Round Robin. We have the hero, Arrow Pharaoh. And then we've got the absolute legend, Peyton Perkins. Once again, got to get a huge thanks to all of them for becoming Unlock Plus Plus members here on YouTube.